Let's do it again. Back to the first tab. This is going to be a utility bill one. So I'm just going to hit the plus button up top. We're going to go then to a bill form. Bill it out. And this one's going to be for Edison. So we have Edison in there already because we did that last month. I'll just keep the same date. The due date is what we would want to put from the bill. And then I just need to pick the category that we used last time. So I used utilities and uh, I'm going to use my thought process is I typically use utilities for the 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 gas and electric. And then I break out the phone to its own account personally and other stuff to its own account oftentimes. But that's just a convention and it will depend on what you think is important to subcategorize for you. Uh, the general idea these days would be the phone bill has become so much that it's kind of its own thing to me and the gas and electric can kind of be grouped together still and that's uh, okay general that's how I think of it but you know it's not set in stone there's nothing that's in the stone that you like you can't move it because it's in it because the rock is heavy and it's been put in the stone and you don't have any chisels or anything that's not how it is you can you can change it so I'm going to go down and say we've got the accounts payable and so there's now this one that we put in there where did it go where did it go where did, there's Edison it's right there what are you blind you blind your eyeballs not working today let's go to the to the income statement my eyeballs are just fine thank you very much where's although they are a little red because I have a they've been irritated I think I need to go on dark mode I need to run the thing on dark mode anyways here's the utility on this side and then the accounts payable is gonna say Edison has a bill there's that 4548 that's where we stand now back to the first tab ties out looks good now if we were gonna pay these items of course now we've, we we want to sort these and see which of them's uh, them's we want to pay now we could sort them multiple different ways as we saw before I can go to the first tab what will typically happen is you'll go into possibly the the vendor center under the expenses tab and then vendors close this up and you can sort the open bills and see the vendors that have open bills 